and I'm Sam. Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to our channel. channel. Today we're doing Last Gymnast to Fall in the Pool wins a mystery prize. So we'll be doing a series of acro gymnastic challenges in and around the pool and basically whoever falls in the least wins that mystery prize. Challenge number one, first twin to push up into a bridge on the floaties wins. We've done this challenge before and I actually won, so I'm feeling pretty confident. Wait, what, you won last time? I don't remember that. I did. No. <laughs> I have to win this time. Just to prove that Tegan isn't the best at this challenge, it's we'll on. see. Guys, before the swim rings go into the pool, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We'll give you guys five seconds. Ready? Four, three, two, one. Thanks for subscribing. Welcome to our family. Warming up over there, I see. By the way, first to five wins. Go! Oh my god! Oh my god, these are small and they're big! These are so slippery! I don't know if I can loved our sticker challenge on the tumble mat, so that's why round two involved the tumble mat. You guys know the drill. Like the video before the tumble mat goes in the pool. Three, two, one. Whoop. Challenge number two, handstand competition on the tumble mat. We know how hard this is. <laughs> we were saying, we know how hard this is from the sticker challenge, I couldn't even kick up into a handstand. But Tegan got up. I had to prove myself. <laughs> Let's go. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> It has to be a balance. Yeah, the winner has to at least hold it for three whole seconds. Three, two, one, go! Three, two, one, go! So apparently I held that for 23 seconds. I hope that's enough. Good. guys but the whole time you're just you're like, fighting because it's constantly moving it's constantly like this underneath you rather than a still beautiful floor okay Sam hands there <laughs> next challenge is bridge battle it's actually double bridge battle because we've got a bridge and we're doing a bridge I need to point wait is that practicing I see first person to get pushed in the pool loses <laughs> so obviously guys we just we can't get each other in so we are going to result back to the normal one which is just whoever can push the other twin in first let's go this will be fun i love this challenge comment down below right now who do you think is going to get pushed in first I'm currently in the lead by quite a bit, but I know Sam's really good at catching up, so I really have to stay on my game. Next is a pop quiz. First twin to three points wins. The person answering the question is going to be held over the pool. If they get the answer wrong, they're dropped into the pool. 
I don't know if you're gonna get this one. It's to do with fashion. I'm really scared, I don't wanna go in. Who invented the little black dress? Audrey Hepburn. Oh my god. <laughs> that was actually a good guess. The answer is Coco Chanel. This is about a pop star. Oh, I like that. Come on. Where is Billie Eilish from? LA. <laughs> I knew Did that one too. Do you know why I know that? I was watching the James Corden show and they go to her house in LA. That was an easy question, guys. Come on. Lean on back. <laughs> Touch your arms. <laughs> what year did the man land on the moon? Oh, 1967. <laughs> when was it? 1969. Which athletic brand used to be called Blue Ribbon Sports? <laughs> I said Adidas. <laughs> I didn't hear what she was said. It, Nike? it was Nike. No, oh, that was me on the kiss. You guess Nike. I'm up. What is the name of the coffee shop in Friends? Central Perk. Yes! <laughs> I watch Friends every night. We are one all. Sam's final question is about Disney. Okay. What was Disney's first feature film? Um, what's that guy with the nose? Pinocchio? <laughs> 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 Yes, there you go. <laughs> when I guessed it, I guessed Pinocchio as well. Oh, no. It's off to work. Okay, so now. Okay, tiebreaker. What flower represents. Um... A puppy! <laughs> was that what? That no, was the was I don't even. What was the question? That was the question. Was it was not. What flower represents Japan? The blossoms! That's the blossom. one! See ya! Oh, I am one point away from winning this whole challenge. This is awesome. <laughs> I'm actually excited for the mystery prize. <gasps> I forgot there was a prize. The next challenge is a gymnastic swimming race. So we're gonna start by doing an acro trick on the tumble mat, then we're diving in, racing to the end, getting out of the pool, and finishing with a handstand on top of the wall. So the first twin to hit the handstand wins. I'll see you at the end. <laughs> Only just Sam. Oh, finally, guys, I won. I've still got time to catch up, right? Welcome to the game. Thank you so much. <laughs> the next round is an underwater search challenge. We will be looking for this. A rip your twins key ring. So the first twin to find this wins. Tegan is all you need is your phone. Okay. New iPhone? Could you imagine? That would have, that would have been epic. <laughs> but it's something that Sam can't see, so she's gonna have to go. Bye! This sucks. Guess what we've got? We've what? got the final mock up of your merch hoodie. Oh my gosh. Okay. Guys, they're exactly what we wanted! They look so good! Yes, we have new hoodies dropping. Sam has not seen the final look, but I know you guys are gonna love them and I can't wait to show Sam. Congrats to Tegan for winning this challenge. Make sure you comment down below any other pool challenges you wanna see. This week's shout out goes to Amanda Rogers, triple six. If you wanna be shouted out next week, all you have to do is comment on this week's video and like and subscribe. We'll see you guys next week. See ya! Oh.